Hey everyone, this is Deanna. Welcome to my channel. Today I have a haul from Timu. I've had it sitting in my craft room for maybe a couple of weeks and I just have not had the time to go through it or do a video. So today I'm um, going to share what I hauled and my previous Timu was sponsored by um, Timu and this is not sponsored by Timu. I spent my own money and so let's jump right in and I just want to say Timu is amazing. You could do a 30-day price check so if you order something and your items go cheaper in that 30 days they'll refund your money if they give you a shipping date and they fail to make that shipping date they give you a five dollar credit um, if you have never ordered from them i'll have a discount code and you get an extra 30 percent off and a bundle that i will have everything listed in the description box below and i'll try to um, list some of these items. If not, please leave me a comment and I will get back to you. So the first thing I bought was these molds and it's just a variety. Christmas trees, gingies, a snowman, snowflakes, a Santa's hat, and these were really reasonable, and for some reason, I received two. So, I'm going to set one aside, and I'm going to be doing a giveaway really soon, and that will be one of the things that will be in it. I, and my sponsored video, I had hauled some resin, so I'm really excited to try it. I haven't had the chance and then I did haul these snowflakes mold and a candy mold. So I thought that would just get me started and just to see if I like it. I know that when I receive resin pieces that my friends make me, um, I just love them. So I'm really excited. The next thing is this and this was really reasonable it's that air clay I think it's called and I think you can make and it comes with the tools and let's see sorry for the pencil but they come in individual little packs and I think you can make like flowers and um, what, I, I mean, it, it's endless what you could do with this. And then I think what people do is put a little touch of resin on it, or I'm not quite sure. So I'm going to have fun playing with that when I get a chance. And if it turns out, I'll come back and share it with you. So the other stuff, I have no idea what's in this bag. And I'm just going to dive in. Ooh, so I, these are some yellow disco balls, and I believe these might be like, um, uh, well, there's 20 pieces in it. I'm not sure the millimeter, but these will be perfect for like pokey tools, those, um, pins that you can alter. I got some lime green ones. Perfect for springtime. Some white ones. And let's see what else is in my little bag. Oh, I ordered some little measuring cups for the resin. Um, I'm not sure. It says 20 pieces, so they must, yeah, they're stacked in there pretty good. You can see that. So perfect. Like I said, I can't wait to dig in and see how I do. I ordered some pink disco balls. Very pretty. And I ordered these 
these are the what you make shakers out of. So I've seen a couple people haul these and you just fold them down and you can make cards, put them on your projects. And so I thought I'd give those a try. You, let's see. It doesn't say how many are in here, but I would say at least five to 10 in each one. So I'm excited to try that. And here's some, this is an interesting color. I wanna say, so here's the pink. So it's kind of a reddish orange, maybe? Um, it doesn't, it's, it says red, but, um, it's, it's more, it's not like a red, red. So I did get those. Let's see what's in. I picked up some Hishi beads and these are, um, I think they're like metallic, but I just, wanted a variety because I work a lot with Yishi beads. Let's see what's in here. Oh, okay. Some Christmas tree paper clips. Let's take one out. I must have got these on a good sale because I don't remember getting these, but I do like paper clips for like journals. And I did do or a TN. I did a late uh, Christmas TN and that will be really cute in it. So I like that. And I ordered these little safety um, pins. I thought this would be really cute to hang a charm off of. Um, you could put these like on ri ribbon samples, um, just bundle it up and uh, attach it with this with like a little charm for a swap. You get 80 pieces, so quite the variety. Love the colors. Um, I hauled this die and so it must have been right after Christmas, probably late January, I received this order. So that's going to be really cute. And here's some more Hishi beads in different colors of pink. And they have a different shine to them. So I want to say they're metallic. Not sure. And I'd have to go and look at the order, but I love these colors for spring. That's going to be really cute. And then my obsession with mini art, little nail art minis. And I have a, an acrylic drawer, one for all of my charms and one for all of my mini arts. But look at the cows. Aren't those adorable? And you get a lot. Like, I want to say at least 30. Yeah, it looks like 30. So you get that. I'm just going to put those right there. And here's some more. Oh, I bet these are for Valentine's Day, which is long come and go come and gone and i'm just now getting to this but i'll have next year and they don't necessarily have to be for valentine's day but they're little tiny bears that say love he's just so adorable so how cute is that and here's some I did order these for Valentine's Day and I missed out, but a lot of the collections I work with have the pink and red and white, and I love working with those colors. 
So these are just shaker balls. Love those. And I believe those were really pretty cheap. And then another Valentine's Day thing. Let's see if I can open it. They're little locket hearts. And I thought that these would be really cute on projects. They don't necessarily need to be for Valentine's Day, but um, super cute. So a pack of those. And let's see, there's more. Oh, look at these little tiny, sorry for the crinkles. But I have to show you these. These will be perfect for Easter. So I'm glad I found them. Isn't she cute? Adorable. And I would say you get at least 20, maybe. Let's see. 10. It looks more than 10 to me, but. And then. I guess I ordered some all different size of the silver disco balls, which I'm really happy with because you get the little tiny ones all the way up to the bigger ones. And I like that for, um, you can use them for spacers or just um, put them on dangles. So I'm really happy with that. And then let's see what's in this little package. Sometimes things sit in my cart for so long and then I order them and I forget. So this is like a star. Those will be really pretty for like the 4th of July or any time. So you get, I would say at least 10 in the pack. And then here's some more. This is more of a, almost a peach color. So um, these are, let's see if it says, it says pink, but it's more of a peach color. Let's see. And then some more pinks. And I love the turquoise. And so I'm, I'll have a lot of fun playing with those. And then here's some clay bits and they're little penguins, if you can see, and snowflakes. So I love work, uh, this for shakers. And then these are some bows, some gold bows. Let's see. You get a ton of them. But they'll be really cute, like, um, on a die cut, like a bear, or put it in on the hair, or whatever you want to embellish. So really cute. So they're just a flat back, kind of a flat back. They're not a bead, and you get 20 of them. And then I ordered some clay bits. Again, I'll save those for next year. Here's some hearts. You can use those anytime if you're working with those colors. So cute. And then the red, pink, and white, which is I just love that combo. Just so cute. And then some pink shaker balls. You get a ton in here. And we're getting to the bottom of the bag. And I thought I had ordered this in a different order, but um, it's an owl, and so I could poke holes in my project instead of using, like, my pokey tool or whatever, and I want to do some embroidery. 
um, things. So I thought every craft room needs one of those. Some more silver disco balls. You get 50 pieces and they're 10 mm, so 10 millimeters. So I'll be set in the silver department. And then here's some sil silver bows, just like the gold ones. So I'm not going to take them out of the package. And these snowflakes that I absolutely love. And I think I've hauled this before and I wanted to just add to my collection because look at how pretty they have a rhinestone in the middle. And I would say you get 20, yeah, 20. Super cute, love them. And then some more balls, shaker balls. And some more rabbits. Let's see. I mean, how cute is he? He's like an iridescent little rabbit. And it says love. And you get... Hmm, I'm not sure how many, but you get a bag full. There's at least 20 in there. And here's some more little rabbits. I had Easter on my mind and spring crafting. He has a carrot in his head. Can you see that? Isn't he cute? So, you get, I would say, at least 20 of those. And more cows. These are a little different. I would really like to do like a barnyard swap where there's pigs and cows and sheep. How fun would that be? Ah. So these are the new ones. So cute. Every time I see a cow, it makes me just want to moo because we have a ton up at our property and, and we're always laughing about them. And then here's some metallic white heishi beads. These are actually really cool. I can't wait to, to use these and maybe mix them with some flat black ones. I have a BB craft haul coming in in a collaboration probably in a week or two and this is going to be perfect for one of the projects. And then I ordered this single snowflake and I thought it came with a bunch but it only came with one. But that's okay. It's gorgeous. So I could just save it for a special project and that'd be really cute like on a traveler's notebook the front of it or just any winter project so that's my timu haul today and i'm gonna be coming on with um some stuff that i've kind of set aside that I just haven't had a chance to share and some things that were sent to me. So I hope that you'll stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I hope that you'll consider. I'm hoping that I'll get back into my craft room and start doing some project shares again and, and have some time this spring. So have a great day. I'll catch you on the next crafty video. Bye.